everyone, we're back. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I am playing some Cult of Cthulhu. So when we last left off... Okay, I can. I had to just deal with some mouse settings for a second. When we last left off, we found out Sarah Hawkins was alive. Mr. Pierce, <laughs> we were waiting for you. Hi! Good. Sarah doesn't have much time. What are you doing here? <laughs> Did you think I would let you confront the occult without supervision? Excuse you. <laughs> this is too dangerous for a bookworm like you. Algernon. Also, fix your tie. I need to talk to Mr. Pierce. Very well, Sarah. I will be in Charles Hawkins' office. Okay. Hey, Sarah. We need to have a discussion. <laughs> you seem different. You're alive. Yes. When I woke up this morning, my mind was sharper. Cleaner. Okay. I can still hear the voice calling me. It is so strong. So ancient. Enticing. Dangerous. Then we need to I leave the island. To escape his grip, but for now, I can keep it at bay. We need to leave the island. I know what I owe you, Mr. Pierce. But I can't come back to Boston with you. <sighs> no, fuck occultism. I know what they're like where that for leads. A long time, <laughs> hiding each other's secrets. I trust him. What are you planning to do? I must find it and kill it. I am the only one who can end its slaughter. No. No, you will come with me to Boston. It's a pretty good idea, I honey. Oh, you know obedience. This She's not wrong. About what you want or don't want to do. You would risk destroying the world just because you can't face the consequences of your actions. Okay, he's not wrong. <laughs> I am willing to atone for my sins. No. You're just trying to erase all proof of the mistakes you've made. I know what I have done. I will not rest until the creature is sent back to its dimension. I'm not going to fucking speak Raylan. Fuck off, game. <laughs> You will get us all killed. Listen, Algernon knows of a way to protect me. Help him find what he seeks, and we may all survive this. This battle. is going to end so poorly, seem Sarah. Like I have much choice. Sarah, this is going to end so badly. You're gonna get us all killed. You're gonna get us all killed, lady. Sword God. Frickin' Cthulhu wants you as his frickin' prophet or some sh stupid shit. Where the hell was his office? Was it upstairs? God, I can't remember. <laughs> Seeing as this is the first time we've actually explored the entirety of the mansion. During... Oh, hell no, I forgot about that. Um, this is the first time we've really explored this in the daytime, actually, because I think it was cut off. No, this is the kids' room. Was it here or was this the paint? No, this is the um, art studio. So it's downstairs then. <laughs> Again, we haven't searched most of the mansion area since the beginning of the game. At least not that I'm aware of. Algernon! Algernon! Where's your butt? I need to talk to it. Hi! There he is. Seeing you again. Ah, it's you. <laughs> that was a weirdly written line. Not you. Fuck off! <laughs> I don't care why you're here. Your usefulness is the only thing that matters. No. How do we protect Mrs. Hawkins from the influence of the forces that claim her? By following Charles Hawkins. That imbecile of a thief, of course. That's not what the subtitle says. What do you says. mean? <laughs> he found something. An amulet. The symbol engraved on it could protect Sarah. Could. Could? We are dealing with forces that by far surpass what your intellect can process. Bet you it fails. Feel free to ask me any question regarding the matters that exceed your grasp. Bet you it fails. I'm not gonna fucking speak Raylan. Shut up, game. Stop trying to get me to speak Raylan. It's not gonna fucking work. The dagger with a strange sign. Was it you who sold it to Francis? I'm not gonna do it. Shut up, game. If you are referring to the dagger of the ancients, then yes, it was me. What? Don't worry about it. Do you know what he intended to do with it? Francis was primarily a collector of occult objects. He liked rare items such as the dagger. <laughs> but I doubt he knew its purpose. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It allowed me to send the creature you call the Shambler back into the painting. I stabbed it. Fascinating. 
but I am afraid that this might only be short-lived. Probably seeing as it attacked me already. Thing could come back. Yes, that is why I am looking for a more permanent solution. I mean, it did attack it me in the insane asylum. <laughs> You're gonna f game, stop giving me the option to speak rail, and I'm not gonna do it. I am very well versed in the mythos. <laughs> Probably too well versed, seeing as I'm married to Cthulhu. But <laughs> this creature, the Shambler. Not gonna do it. What is it? <laughs> not gonna it do is it. a hunter. It travels from one dimension to another to hunt down its prey. Okay. Francis Sanders was one of its victims. How could a creature like that end up in one of Mrs. Hawkins' paintings? Sarah has an uncommon gift. A connection with entities that live beyond our reality. Wonderful. I doubt that she was aware at the time, but when she painted the picture in a certain way, she called it. And now it remains in our reality. Let us say that it uses the painting as a portal into our reality. And we make enticing prey for Burn it. Burn the painting. That's why we must <laughs> find a way of sending it back to where it came from permanently. Again, that doesn't match. I'm not gonna... A genius like you must have already... Stop giving me the option, game. It's not gonna goodness. work. <laughs> Unless I, I misclick. I sense your sarcasm, but it does <laughs> happen that, yes, I do have a solution. Please don't misclick, Scarlet. I think I can destroy it. But for that, I must approach the creature. And to be able to do so, I need the key to Rie. Another one of your baubles. It is no bauble, <laughs> unbeliever. It is a very powerful protection. Able to repel very ancient forces. Much more effective than your cult. I have a gun? What does it mean? <laughs> it's one. It is a golden amulet, bearing very ancient inscriptions and an elder sign at its center. A star with an eye in the middle. I've already seen that sign. Where can we find it? Therein lies the problem. That foul thief Charles has hidden it somewhere. I found this drawing among his personal effects. I think that it has something to do with the location of the amulet. Puzzle time! I'll follow this lead. You continue searching. That is what I intend to do. As for you, return here the second you find it. I don't want it to disappear again. <laughs> this guy's such a nerd. Why is this on my hand? <laughs> Not that one. That one has hair. Sure, let's go down into the dark abyss. I'm sure it's gonna end well. Damn it. The entrance to the tunnel has been buried following <gasps> the cave in. Cool. But at least I didn't dream it. Eh, you probably dreamed a lot of other things, though, dude. Okay. So we're looking for a bald bust. Massive tracts of land. I bet you anything, it's probably in the study with the creepy ass fucking floor symbol. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> I honestly guessed. <laughs> I swear to God. Okay. I swear to God, I honestly guessed it. Where's my lantern? I don't know. Give me the lan- Give me the fucking lantern, game! <laughs> oh my God. This game's controls are so finicky. Okay. Change. Thank you, game. Okay, I'm looking for a skull. I'm 
mean, that's the statue. At least it looks like it, but it's not the right. Wait, who drew these? Did Sarah draw these or did... What's this fucking fuck draw them? No, fuck off, land. land God damn it! I hate these controls. No, fucking go away. Okay, thank you. God, this game. Uh. Oh shit, Bradley! How are you, Brad? <laughs> ah, it's you, Pierce. Hi, Bradley. I'm just worried about Marie. I mean, Dr. Colden. Have you had any news? I'm so sorry, Bradley. I could do nothing to save her. Sorry, dude. What do you mean? What happened? Fuller did it. I'm not sure what happened. But I found her body in the cellars of Riverside. You... You sure that you've got nothing to do with it? Excuse me? If she hadn't tried to help you, she might still be alive. Probably. I'm sorry. Truly. It's that slug, Fuller. I swear I'll shoot him. Do it. Save me what the trouble. Say, Pierce? Are you with me? <laughs> Stop giving me the option game, I swear to God. <laughs> you knew her better than I did, but don't you think that it would betray Marie's way of thinking? Again, subtitles she didn't match what they spoke. Saving lives. <laughs> So wouldn't killing someone in cold blood be contrary to her convictions? Yeah. You're probably right. I feel so sorry for Bradley. We must do something for those who are still alive, Bradley. Sarah is still in danger as long as the cult is active. We need to see this through, otherwise Marie's death will have been in vain. You're, uh, the voice of reason, Pierce. As always. Oh, I do... What? what is with, like, this particular episode of this game and none of the fucking subtitles matching what they're saying? Or did I just not notice that happening before? Oh, hey. Hey, look, a box. An obvious box that sticks out like a sore thumb. Hey, Drake. This is the amulet that Drake was looking for. I didn't do it. <laughs> I probably did it. Okay. So somebody told me that um, if I upgrade... Oh, I have nine CP available. Um, somebody told me if I upgrade psychology, I'll be able to stay in hide spots for longer. That's the kind of thing I'm okay with learning in comments is like game mechanic-y stuff. Uh, don't give me advice or tips on puzzles or upcoming areas. I consider those spoilers, but if it's game mechanic stuff, like the fact that psychology gives you, um, the ability to hide and hide spots for longer, that I'm okay with. Let's double check our sanity real quick. Great. Wonderful. Psychotic? I'm psychotic! <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> Not psychotic, shut up! <laughs> Fuck occultism. I don't want it. I want more medicine. Medicine's good. Um... BAM! Nobody can tell me no anymore. <laughs> no, I can investigate out the ass. Ass, ass, ass. Boom. Okay, then I might get a couple in psychology after this. We'll see. Fuck you, game. I'm not psychotic. <gasps> Oops, that's not what I meant to hit. Look. Why is there still things here? You want me to look at all the things that I've unlocked? It still says that there's something here I'm missing. Oh, fuck it. Show the amulet to Drakey Boy. Bye, Bradley. Sorry about Marie. I did the best I could. I swore. <laughs> you know, I kind of wonder how long she was dead or being experimented on. Because theoretically, if we just missed it, if we just missed the chance to save her, 
because the Dimensional Shambler attacked us uh, in the asylum. It's kind of a dick move. <laughs> I think I've found what we're looking for. Stop giving me the option. Let me see that. I'm not going to do it. Yes, that's it. It's perfect. We are saved. I must tell Mrs. Hawkins. Yes, do that. Oh, hey, it's just giving me freaking C points like it's candy. Um, actually, yeah. Oh, fuck it, I'll throw one in. Why not? Even though psychology seems to only be useful when talking to people. Oh shit, what are you doing here, lady? I don't. I have it. It's a strange amulet. I hope it will protect you, considering that nothing will help you change your mind. You must understand. I already went too far. What have you seen that's so terrible you convinced yourself that you had to risk so much? I can't tell you now. This story is going to end back. Yes, it is. I yeah. bet you anything. Chief West is here with Sullivan. Okay. Bradley. You take care of Sarah. I will deal with them. You sure? All right. This is gonna end well. I love how Bradley's- we, we have a good cop on our side. It's very rare. Good cops are very, very rare. I've been hearing about you a lot lately. Hi. You seem to enjoy causing trouble. I didn't do shit. Nice job, Chief. You got me. Great police work. You can try to play smart with me all you want, Pierce. Witnesses have identified you as the one who set fire to Riverside. Witnesses? How convenient. <coughs> That's not the whole story, is it? Just don't go inside the I building. I don't care about your stories. Save them for the judge. Just don't go inside the building to see the totally alive Sarah. Cops, we base our investigation on facts and testimonies. You might want to try that next time. You bet I will. <laughs> As you can tell, I'm not the biggest fan of the police. But if you followed my Twitch streams, you would know that already. <clears throat> Sure, this is gonna end well. Great, I'm in the police station. More sober than Zadok Allen. <laughs> I did not take a single drink. Ya yeah, boy. Ya yeah, boy, I'm sober as fuck. <laughs> but seriously, alcoholism is bad, and since we we're told in literally the first like scene that he has a problem with alcoholism, I'm not gonna make him drink. <sighs> Even though apparently that locks out a good ending. <laughs> Yeah, I avoided nearly all the spoilers from this game. But there are a couple spoilers I couldn't avoid. Because <laughs> this game's been out for two years? Thereabouts. But I still avoided most of them. Dun dun dun! Dun dun dun! Nice bullets out in plain view on the desk there. You know, I've heard a lot about you, Mr. Pierce. All good, I hope. It appears that you've been involved in a variety of misdemeanors since your arrival on Darkwater. It's fine. Entering private property twice. Aggression, insulting behavior, and to top it all, arson. Insulting behavior is not a misdemeanor. What the fuck are you talking about? Listen, in my line of business, we are obliged to overstep certain limits. We're not just talking about illegal surveillance. You were being accused of serious crimes. That's fine. There's nothing serious in what you've said. And you've got no proof that I started the fire. Don't you worry. I'll find some. Yeah, yeah, You're going to yeah. waste time and effort on me while terrible things are happening on this island. Yeah? So what's going on that I don't know about? A lot! 
you'd be better off taking an interest in Dr. Ford. Master investigation. The experiments <laughs> he carries out on his patients are as inhuman as they are illegal. And when Dr. Colden wanted to put a stop to it, she too went under the knife. What are you talking about? Nobody's reported any wrongdoings. Dr. Fuller is a man who is as much respected and admired on the island as he is in his profession. It seems like you've got a grievance against him. Is that why you set fire to his institute? I'm admitting nothing at all. Come on, I'll show you to your new residence. I'll be back later to ask you some questions. Fuck off, dude. I hope that you'll make the right choice and confess to everything. Well, I hope you it get attacked by the dimensional shambler. As it would be for me if I had to adopt more advanced questioning. Patriot Axe. No doubt about that. Good night, Mr. Pierce. Mm -hmm. Patriot Axe. <laughs> Mr. Pierce. The truth seeker. Fuck off, Cthulhu. I mean, I love you, you're my yeah. husband, but... Hmm. Don't seem to need to breathe. Sup? I am the one men named Leviathan. Not because of the scale of my terrestrial form, but as a reminder of the immensity of my knowledge. Okay. Which I came to share with you, human. Oh, I'm drowning. I am drowning. Okay. Do not struggle. You will not be able to speak or escape my influence. I told you to behave. Fuck you. <laughs> I am way too genre savvy to submit to you. <laughs> Follow the path that leads to your freedom. This is an offer that the likes of you, particularly those with such rare characteristics, cannot refuse. The more you bend your human spirit to make it able to receive the truth, the closer you will come to embrace his power. So you're not Cthulhu? Is Leviathan's not another name for Cthulhu? Truth seeker. Would you like to see her? Oh fuck. Sarah, what are you doing? No, fuck Your you. Your mind must open itself willingly, or the truth will immediately shatter it. I'm too genre savvy for you, my dude. Our paths shall cross again, truth seeker. To a genre savvy for you, my friend. Sarah. You know the risks. <laughs> if you happen to use your powers again, you you may lose more than your life. Yeah. It is not about me, but innocent lives. I hope that your sources are reliable. And if you crack, the entire world will die. The bootleggers have the painting. If the dimensional shambler is to appear, he will do it here. <gasps> the shambler. I knew it! No! Not again! Sa oh, I'm Sarah now! Okay! Okay, I guess I'm Sarah. Algernon, come back! God damn it, Drake. Where is Algernon? And the Shambler. What the fuck is that Marie? No, that's Cat. Okay. <laughs> For a second, from far away, it looked like, um... It looked like Marie Colden because of the shirt, and then I realized they were wearing pants. Back. Oh, you're fine. Stop bitching. Cat! Oil. Good to know. Dead people! 
There's a shambler here. There's a shambler here. Kitty cat. Kitty cat. Hey! You can't leave us. Sorry, old friend, but it's either you or me. Cat, you're such an asshole. <gasps> no. Oh no. Open! Open! Open up! Open this door! It's here. Rip. Yeah, we go, we go now. Fuck. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. Oh no. Shit. The beast is within our reach. No, I don't like this plan. Are you sure you want to do it? Let's go. Quickly, come with me. This is a bad idea. Okay. Okay, what's up? How do we kill it? The Shambler can open breaches between dimensions. Okay. He uses glyphs as anchors to stay in our world. Okay. Then I must destroy these glyphs. Exactly. Wait, why are you wearing the I amulet? Can <laughs> I will make the glyphs visible so you can revoke Aren't them. I supposed to be wearing by the amulet? So, this zone will be protected by a barrier. Perfect. Stay inside the shield. I'll create the protective barrier. Get back inside it as soon as you sense the slightest danger. Okay. So I have to destroy some glyphs? The first glyph must have appeared somewhere on the floor. Okay. Oil. Oh, I don't like this. Find that symbol, Sarah. <gasps> oh, I found it. The glyph. I can't move it. Is it acting against me? The ritual is working. Don't worry. It's just until I ward it off. Oh, okay. No. The wanderer is back. Where is it? The glyph is with us. Does this work? Oh, I can I can slow it down with this. I'm stuck. Fuck off. Fuck off. <laughs> I get wrecked. <laughs> the second symbol has been revealed. Okay. You know what you have to do, Sarah. Okay. You, you say that... Like, seriously, shouldn't I be wearing the amulet? Aren't we supposed to be protecting my sanity here? Okay. The oh, there it is. Must have appeared. Let's press on. No, no, it's right here. How do I get in there? Oh, no, I don't like this. No, seriously, it's like, it's right there. What the fuck, game? The symbol must be here somewhere. Look closely. That is what I'm doing. <laughs> Shut up, nerd! Also, I'm totally running out of oil, so, like... Oh, there we go. Okay, but, like, how do I get in there? The second glyph must have appeared. Let's press it's on. right there! Can I- Oh, I can move it. Okay. <gasps> I was gonna say. Face. <laughs> the symbol must be here somewhere. You startled me by 
friend. I have the impression the shambler is trying to anticipate our. You don't fucking say. <laughs> okay. The second glyph must have appeared. Let's press on. He's getting stronger and more aggressive. If he catches up with you, try blinding him. What do you think I'm doing? Fuck face. <laughs> oh fuck! This is fine. Oh, I got stuck on a wall. <laughs> Fuck off! Hi! Okay. One more, Drakey boy. Now is when matters get complicated. I must breach the barrier to ward off the creature. Um, what? You have to lure it in front of me, Sarah. Do you understand? Once it goes after you, I need you to guide it towards me. This is a bad idea. Okay. I don't like this. I don't like this. Fuck off with your noises, game. Now it's out of there. I'm sure of it. Okay. Wait, you said the glyph is near over here. No. Okay, fine. <laughs> this is not near. Algernon. Goober. Oh shit, no, never mind. <laughs> We're almost there, sir. Release me now! Algernon! Gun, quickly! Bring him towards me! Fuck off! I got stuck on a wall! Doing it right? Oh, I have to use the painting. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, it's right there, duh. Fuck off! Let's go, Sarah. It's over. Ya yeah, boy! Do you hear something? Sarah? I can hear him. He calls me. Sarah? Sarah! No! Algernon. My old friend. It's too late. Grab her! Drake, grab her! Grab her! Grab her! Well, she has been seduced by the mythos because, which you know is exactly what. Drake warned of, Pierce warned of, Bradley probably wouldn't have been happy about. <sighs> yep, she has succumbed to the call of the myth. Yep, Sarah Hawkins is now gone completely insane. 
which is exactly what she was warned against. And she's like, oh, I have to save innocent people. And now she's going to try to kill all of them. Well, I guess we have to put her down like old Yeller. Shrug. Also, I've been going for way too long. Second I get a chance, I'm going to have to end the video. <gasps> Sarah Hawkins. Why did she do it? Damn it. Sarah, you fucking idiot. Okay, I'm going to talk to you in a minute. Did her <laughs> My name is Scarlet Tanager, and I have been playing some Call of Cthulhu. I'll see you all in the next video.